Hello folks and welcome to my new edition uh, or my most recent edition in fact of the Super Server Call Dudes Diaries Server Diaries and um, well I've got some good news for you I have some more equipment in my rack since my last video uh, and as you can see it zooming in there you can see uh, as promised my new UPS it's an APC I believe it's a 1300 VA so it gives that around 11 or 1200 watts of power for around 5 to 5 to 15 minutes possibly a bit more I'm not sure of its complete configuration um, as I'm waiting for the serial lead to go in the back so I can uh, sort of manage it anyway let's go into the rack here you go so here is my APC 3000 I found out there it is right there uh, APC 3000 and as you can see I have two of them now if you cast your mind back, uh, mind back to uh, some of my recent, vid my other sort of recent videos that I've done in this uh, in this series, you'll see that I've got the uh, two two um, 2650s here, Dell Powerhead 2650s, and behind this story was the fact that I brought this one and managed to get this one for free. Uh, well, uh, you guessed it, the same's happened again. Uh, oh, basically, this one here didn't work. Well, all it really was was the batteries were low. So I asked the company who I brought this one off to replace it with a new one, which they did. And they replaced it with this one, but never asked for this one back. And the only difference you can tell these apart is one's got the Brazil uh, and one hasn't. Um, this one works quite well, and I shall demonstrate in just a moment how this works. Right, let's get ahead and demonstrate how the UPS works. Uh, and I'll show all, all the, as you can see above here, you can see my equipment is running uh, and as is the equipment at the top there, you can just about see some lights anyway, that's all the equipment that's running in the rack and I'll prove to you in just a moment that this uh, UPS operates so if you watch the lights very carefully in this video I'm now going to zip over to the uh, to the main sort of PDU unit which you, I've showed you in past videos I won't show you this time but remember that isolation switch that I showed you in that PDU uh, isolation switch in the PDU board product that I've uh, showed in previous videos well I'll go over there now and press that button and you keep an eye on the UPS lights there and you'll see exactly what happens uh, and as you can see there um, you'll hear it doing a series of beeps uh, and the light se sequence has changed as you can see there we've just lost one battery light which is fine we know it's on the UPS uh, and you'll see this uh, orange light displayed right here that means it's actually using the battery power uh, and in a moment that will switch to probably either one of these two lights here which will show that the power has been restored and just to prove a point you can actually see my servers and also my root equipment is still working um, as is the monitor when it's on uh, I haven't actually got it on at the moment so I can't show you but I could possibly turn the power switch on and just to prove this to you there you go um, just hit. there you go and as you can see the, uh, the monitor is working all well and good so yes that's working good so watch what happens when I simulate restoring the power again and as you can see the orange light is now turned to a green light and, and, and is now successfully charging the UPS batteries back up and basically that is the UPS 3000 from APC summed up in a very short time okay folks you have been watching the super server call do diaries server diaries and my name is dean aka super server dude and until next time bye for now please rate comment and subscribe thank you